It's Thursday, June 15, 2017. Some of the clips I'm probably going to put in this video, you may have seen it already. But uh, I have some time now that my son uh, finished check his exam. I decided to sort of put this week's video in one. So some of them might be a bit repetitive. So what I did at the beginning... Uh, that was uh, last weekend when I had some time I decided to sit down and make a plan it was late at night when I did it and uh, this is what I came up with uh, so maybe at the end of the program these might fill in the measurements um, and stuff like that I did record myself trying to measure myself and it didn't go too well. I will put that clip also. So this is me on June 11. So I need to take measurement. I, I could have taken some measurement for my upper body, but I don't really care too much about it. But I only want for my abdominal, quad and calves because, because of my leg situation. So I'm going to use this to measure it. Technically, someone else should be doing it, but... And I never got a chance to even ask my husband to help me with the measurement, like I mentioned in the video. But um, with the weight and, uh, and probably some of the pictures of me to see the improvement, we'll see how, you know, my workout have, have, uh, have worked. So I'm going to skip the measurements, but uh, eventually I'm, I will probably... Uh, I'll have to measure something this week in order for me to keep tracking since this is week one. For the weight uh, track, it's not a problem because this is something that I do every day. The minute I get up, I'm in the bathroom, I weigh myself and I write it in my food log. And at night, before I go to sleep, I write it in my food log. So the, the measurement is not a problem. In terms of weight, it's not a problem. So with the workout schedule as you can see i'm only in week one so far and it had changed slightly you can see what i had planned was that on monday i'm supposed to go to, uh, to the gym and do full body tuesday i'll rest wednesday i go back thursday i would have rest which is today and then go back on friday and then saturday and sunday i'll rest that changed because of my kids schedule um, I mentioned it, I will put it on the video um, where I explain what happened due to my kids switching school and all this stuff, I need to do paperwork. So it had changed. Um, what happened this week is that I went on Monday as planned. Tuesday, I rest. Wednesday, I went to the gym. That's when I started realizing School is going to be closed. I need to do the uh, schoolwork for my kids, do the transferring and all this stuff. And I said, it will be best if I go the following day, which is today. I went to the gym. That way I have enough time to do anything that needs to be done or if I need to go to different place to get paperwork. So at least I have Friday to do that and possibly Monday. So I took care of this week's workout by going to the gym today because Friday I'll have my son with me. Once I transfer him out, he can't go back to the school. So today was his last day. So therefore, Friday he will be with me and I have to go to my oldest son's school for something and bring the paperwork. And then Saturday I'll rest. Sunday obviously is Father's Day and uh, we might have to do something. And then Monday we start the new plan. So. This is what I have so far, 
and let's go. I did some recording over the week about each workout, so I will put it and show you guys. Today is June 12th. June 12, 2017, and it's 11.05. Just came from the gym. Uh, this, today is the beginning of my uh, aesthetic plan, or whatever I call it. Um, so this week, I'll be go do, going to the gym at least three days, and uh, it's full body, so which means there'll be an interval. Like today I went, tomorrow I will not go, and then uh, the following day I'll go and then rest and then so forth so on so that schedule might change a little bit because my son my youngest I need to switch him I need to transfer him to my oldest son's school so which means I do not want to wait until my oldest uh, son's school last day I believe it's either Friday or Monday but I do not want to wait a last minute to take my youngest out because it's two different school, two different schedule, two different time that the school ends. So I'm going based on my older son's school when it ends, uh, which I believe is Monday. So what I'm going to do is to try to take my youngest, transfer my son out either Thursday or Friday. I do not want to wait on Friday just in case there's stuff that I need to do and I need to go different places to get paperwork so that's a, a problem it might interfere with my workout so if that comes into play I probably will adjust it and uh, try to still maintain that three days uh, for this week because I'm doing full body now with that being said Today's workout was pretty good. I wasn't planning on recording anything, but I did two recordings actually. One was when I was in, uh, doing the foam rolling and I realized my uh, flexibility is starting to improve. I was able to touch the ground without man much pain and I recorded it and I did some stuff uh, to see how how it feels and it, it's I recorded it so I'll show you guys that and also I did uh, I remember saying in, in the camera once that uh, I never record when I'm lifting the 40 pound so today I was lifting the 40 pound the area wasn't that packed there was only one person I believe who was doing um, abs and I decided to pull out the camera he had left to go get water so I pull out the camera facing me and obviously I'm pretty sure I'm gonna see other people around and I'll block them um, I position the camera to face me to record myself doing the 40 pounds because in so many videos I'm saying I lift the 40 pound I lift the 40 pound but there's no recording so today I decided to record it because the area was empty so um the thing is that the main reason I didn't really want to record today is to stick to this. I Because I was doing full body, I didn't want to take more than, I don't know, I didn't want to stay in the gym for too long uh, to do the workout. So, uh, and it ended pretty good. I, I had a pretty good, uh, decent workout. Uh, once I tell you my heart rate result and I'll mention, um, I'll see how good I did. So um, over the weekend, I did the, did the plan, for actually for the entire uh, month, for the full uh, four week workout. So this week was a bit more specific. I was really tired. So when I got to two weeks two, actually you could see a portion of it is printed in the sheet. I started doing it and I was falling asleep and I was, uh, I wanted to study with my son. So I was pretty tired. I said, you know what, at least I got week one out of the way and I could always come back and do week two. I need to think properly how I'm gonna do it. So uh, pretty much my workout is already sort of set how I'm gonna do it which I mentioned in one of my videos it's just that to actually put into play which workout is uh, is dedicated or is uh, is for that particular thing that I sort of already highlight I need to think more how I'm gonna do it 
So when I started writing this workout, you know, I put all the workout I usually do. And some of them, you know, there's different ways of doing them, but I list all of them. But when I was uh, writing them, I tried to think uh, the location of them at the gym so I don't have to walk around the gym. So I sort of group them in a way where they sort of close to each other. So, uh, like I said, so I don't have to walk around and, and do, to do each exercise. So, um, for instance, the first group was uh, upper body, which with the dumbbells and cables, and uh, I grouped them somewhat together. Um, and I did upright wall. So all, pretty much all the dumbbells and cables, I sort of grouped them together so that, you know, they are... Um, in the same vicinity and for the leg it's pretty much the same thing but the, like today for instance like I said I did uh, full body the, even though I sort of grouped them in a way I adjusted a little bit based on feel but I still stick to how I did it I did the form rolling I went upstairs did the form rolling and then I did some uh, abs on the basu machine and the uh, back workout once I went downstairs, I decided to do some legs because it's full body. I have to do legs. It's already in there. So I did the abductors and adductors and also the glute machine and calves. Once I did that, I went to the counter, uh, how I, what's the word, what's the term? Based on what I just said, sort of group them together so I don't have to walk around. But based on how I did it today, it's sort of uh, the opposite of that. I did the legs. Uh, part of the legs, the abductors, adductors, glute, and calves in the same area. Then I walk across the gym to go to the dumbbell area to do the bench press and the uh, chest fly, shoulders, uh, chest crossover. Uh, I didn't do chest crossover, it wasn't part of today. Shoulder press and uh, bicep curls and shrugs, all of these. I did that after I did the legs, some of the legs. And then I went back, once I finished it, part of the upper body, I went back to the area where the legs is, uh, leg machines are. I did the hamstring, leg extension, and um, leg press. These are in the machines. So I sort of did leg, upper, leg, upper, leg, upper. And then at the end, I did the obliques. So, um, and next week, only because it was upper body, I wanted... Uh, part of the leg to rest while I'm working the upper uh, and then go back to leg again and then after that go back to upper which was back and stuff like that so that's how I sort of I hope it makes sense uh, that's sort of how I did it uh, did the workout today so based uh, on Wednesday when I go tomorrow I'm not gonna go to the gym uh, when I go to the gym on Wednesday uh, I will do a somewhat similar workout but slightly different for instance today i did foam rolling i'm gonna do that too actually for all of them i'm gonna for all th three days i'll be doing the foam rolling and the, the cable crunch and stuff like that and i'll be doing the bench press with the 40 pounds because this is a new weight that i'm doing since i'm taking break in between uh each days so i feel like i should lift the 40 so i don't get my muscle uh to get my uh, muscles uh, get used to it. So, uh, like I said, today uh, I did uh, chest fly with 20 pounds. Uh, I will not be doing it next time. Actually, I will not be doing it after that. Um, shoulder press, uh, I, did, I did that today. I'll not do it on Wednesday, but I'll do it on Friday. Uh, whatever. The next one, uh, today I did not do chest crossover with cable i did not do that but on wednesday i will do it but i will not do it on on friday uh shoulder press with the cable i did not do that today but i will do it on wednesday uh i did shoulder press today with dumbbells though not the cable so uh it's sort of uh Almost the same workout, but different machines. Uh, so that's just an idea. I will, I will uh, post this. Uh, I am so behind with so many things that I want you guys to have, but uh, I have no time. Um, 
I'll find a way to put this uh, somewhere where you guys can see it. Maybe I'll just put, uh, put it on the, on the screen so you guys could see it, how I sort of did it. Um, so that's pretty much it. Today is June 14, 2017, and it's 11.57. Uh, I did full body today. I don't normally come out of the gym around this time, but I did full body. My uh, heart rate bell stopped working, so I had to go actually record uh, what it was because I was trying to fix it so I didn't have to uh, reset the heart rate because I, uh, the heart rate um, wa uh, monitor. Because uh, I had already burnt like 115 or so calories. So I wanted to keep that. So I took my phone and record uh, that particular amount. I did uh, all of them actually. The time that I started, um, the amount of calories I burnt, my highest heart rate, all of the stuff I usually mention. I recorded on my phone and then I stopped it. Went to the bathroom, reset it and then... Um, I uh, continue my workout so pretty much I will have two sets of uh, heart rate information and I'll just average them out um, to see how the total of them all um, I was looking for my plan I took it with me I think I left it in the gym I have to call uh, the gym to see if they see it because I have some stuff written in there I have it in the computer but there's some other notes I put on the side so uh, I need that paper back um, I'll call the gym to see if they see it um, another thing is that I wasn't planning on recording anything um, but when I was doing the way I sort of wrote the workouts you know I put a check next to each everything that I'm supposed to do for today and there were some that were similar workout like face pull or white bow and shrugs uh, I sort of uh, group them together I mean they I, the way I wrote it they were pretty much uh, spread uh, apart but I when I saw I was supposed to do that today I sort of grouped these three uh, uh, exercises together and I did them um, I did three sets and I ended up uh, my, the fourth set I, I was like while I was doing it the third set also and I was like damn that would be a nice little circuit somebody could do so I record uh, a fourth set I wasn't supposed to do fourth set so I record the fourth set just for the sake of having it and I'll probably post it on uh, I'll post it separately uh, what else did I record one more thing oh when I was doing the, my legs uh what was it it uh i was sitting on it but i actually posted on instagram too when i was do uh the calf um so i record a little bit of that there was something else oh when i was doing the lat pull down the two handle um i also record that and i believe i have another version of it but i'm gonna add that separately to uh put like a little circuit but anyway, uh, this morning, I'm not going to send that text. I need to see. Uh, this morning, before I left, I started uh, doing some cooking. I made some quinoa. And I want, I made a lot. Uh, I made enough for a, a while. And I was going to cook some vegetables. So I took them out of the fridge so I could stir fry it. And then I probably will eat it with, uh, what's that thing? Uh, wrap. So I'm going to do that right now. Let me get my stuff together and then I'll probably record that too. Today is, what is today? June 15, 2017, and it's 10, I mean 8-10. I'm, I'm at the, my summer plan, which I started thinking last, uh, last week, and today is the, uh, this week is the beginning of, of the plan. I went to the gym on Monday, I did full body. I rest on Tuesday. Yesterday I went to the gym. I did full body again. Today I was supposed to rest. And uh, my son, my youngest, need to be transferred out to another school. So there's a little bit co uh, conflict of timing. So I'm going to take him out of school today. 
later on after I come from the gym. And then uh, tomorrow is to bring the paperwork to the new school. So I was trying to wait uh, as close as possible to the last day of school. His last day of school is supposed to be next Thursday. But because the school that he's going to go to, the last day of school is, uh, I believe, Monday. So I need to take him out today. That way, if there's more stuff that I need to do, paperwork or anything like that, at least I have Friday to do it. So by Monday, I could at least um, bring it uh, to the school. So I'm going to do that today, and hopefully they give me the paper. And then Friday, I just bring it and done with it. So I'm going to go to the gym today. Because once I take him out, he's going to be with me. So I'll not be able to go to the gym. So I'm heading to the gym now. Yesterday, I had put a bigger version of this. Um, where the, the first week uh, workout was in a, you know, in a eight and a half by 11. Where it fits all of this. And the, you know, the font size was bigger. Apparently... I don't know where it is. When I came from the gym yesterday, I'm taking stuff out of my bag. I didn't see it. I even called the gym to see if anybody saw it. They returned it. Nothing. I even went back to the uh, gym to search for it. I don't see it. So someone must have picked it up and uh, probably going to follow my plan. But uh, luckily, I didn't, print, I didn't do all of the week's workout. I think I stopped on week two and then uh is it week two or week yeah week two for next week i saw the stop uh and then um i need to do week three four and i put week five just in case there's a little bit discrepancies between those workout at least i could uh, redo them on week five so i decided to print all of them in one you know to fit in this page so that way I don't have to be behind the computer to uh, to do it because sometimes I get tired sitting behind the computer so I have that to at least when I'm sitting down you know with the kids or something like that I could just do uh, fix it because all the workout is already written all I need to put is how I do them on each week so going to the gym uh, I actually I'm still drinking my coffee and I'm going to take a spoon of peanut butter. And then that will be my pre-workout. There's the peanut butter and a spoon. Not even a spoon of uh, peanut butter. And then I'm heading out. I'm not sure I'm going to record because I need to hurry. Because right after the gym, probably going to come take a shower and then go back to the school, to the office. Uh, you know, request for the transferring and then go pick up my son. So that's pretty much it. I'm heading to the gym. Today is June 15, 2017, 1131. Right? So, went to the gym. I was not supposed to go to the gym today. I went because tomorrow, Friday, uh, my oldest has half a day, and I wanted to take my son, my youngest son, out of school, of the school that he's in now. Uh, there's a transfer slip I'm supposed to get, and my, I wanted to do it uh, as close as possible uh, to when the, the school that he's going to go to closes, which is pretty much, I believe tomorrow or Monday is the last day. Technically, for the school, is tomorrow. But on Monday, it will be open. I think they're doing small little parties here and there. So um, I didn't want to wait until Monday to do that. Because my youngest uh, is off, I mean, the, the end of the school year ends on Thursday, the 20, June 22nd. So today is the 15th. So I wanted to pretty much go based on the, uh, the school that he's going to go to schedule. So they're pretty much going to close earlier than his school. So I wanted to get that transfer slip out as soon as possible. And if there's things that I need to do, uh, other paperwork that I need to get, so I could do it before Monday. So, I got it today. There it is. Uh, earlier this morning, before I left, I did say that um, after the gym, I'm going to come here, take a shower, and go take care of it. Something tell me just, on my way here, I went straight to the school, like that. And uh, I had my backpack and stuff like that with me. So luckily I did that because I did not bring 
the acceptance letter with me and the office was kind of packed uh, with uh, kids graduating and uh, parents were asking what's going to happen next year and stuff come September and stuff like that so I'm glad that I went to know that I had to come back and get this letter so I had to get this letter to show them that he's uh, transferring so today pretty much will be his last day of school at that school location and then tomorrow my son is gonna have something my oldest now is gonna have something at his school so I'm gonna bring this with me I'm gonna scan it and email it to them and then tomorrow I'm gonna send, bring it in person just in case something happened to this because I guess I could always go back and get another one but anyway so today's workout Pre went pretty good um, the only thing I did not do was the band uh, for legs exercises uh, I don't know I didn't even bother looking for it I guess I was starting to to, uh, it was starting to be late and I wanted to come home and do a couple things and stuff like that my oldest has half a day so I wanted to do a lot of stuff before I pick him up so um, apparently someone took my plan my one week plan this one I had printed a, a, a bigger uh, scale um, it had taken pretty much uh, the whole eight and a half by eleven paper but uh, I asked around and some of the people that I know were there yesterday when I was working out, one person said they saw, she saw it, but someone must have took it, taken it because uh, I asked, there's a gentleman at the gym who usually, you know, put the weights back and stuff like that. He didn't see it. I asked, you know, the, it's not a big deal, but it's just the thought, you know, anyway. Besides, not only did I, 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 I vote it, but there are different ways of doing it. So who knows if it's going to, whatever. So my workout went pretty well. Um, I did, uh, I did not do foam rolling because yesterday I think I wasted a lot of time. Not really waste, but um, uh, I spent a lot of time doing it. And I ended up leaving the gym like around 12, close to around this time. So because I had so many things to do. I just did minor stretch and then uh, some uh, leg lifts and stuff like that and then I went straight to do some of the workout. Unlike uh, yesterday, uh, I started with some leg uh, exercise. I believe I did, uh, that's yesterday, I did uh, abductors, adductors and the glute machine and the hamstring first. Today I started with the back, back exercises. On Monday I believe I did uh, something a different uh, way. but. Um, I sort of switch it around, but I still stick. I stick to what I want. It's just either I started lower body or upper body. Um, so today I started with upper body, which was back, and I went and did a couple leg exercises and stuff like that. So week one, I really don't know when and where I'm gonna post it. I, I will, as you can see, I have it on spreadsheet, so it's not that hard to give it to you. It's not like I'm going to create something new. It's there. So it's a matter of, of time to sit down and do it properly so you guys could have it, if you care. So, and I didn't record anything. I wanted to record something, um, which I sort of did. I mean, I put it in, in here, but when I realized I need to do which one is that? Lateral raises, front raises, uh, triceps, and upright row. Actually, upright row was not in the thing for today, but I did it. So I should put a check on that. Um, I did it. So when I was doing that, I was like, you know what? I'm going to do this because all of them, upright row I did today. Um, when I, I need to do this upper body with shrugs and everything, shrugs was not in the thing. I put it anyway. I did it because I was... And it was in the same vicinity because I was like, oh, these are all upper body kind of thing. So let me do them on a circuit. So I took, I went in my uh, bag to, I bought the camera with me, but the stand was not in my bag. I left it on my, uh, on, on my desk. So that's the, uh, that's the only reason why I didn't record it. I, if I had the stand, I would have recorded because it was a nice little circuit that someone can do, you know, just, you know, 
uh, uh, just a nice little circuit I think that could give someone ideas so uh, I didn't record it but I did it I did three sets of all of them um, in a circuit non-stop uh, so yeah that's pretty much it today's plan is done I mean this week's plan is done uh, I will not be going to the gym tomorrow I'll be very busy I have both my youngest is gonna be with me because today is his last day I just signed him out of the school um, I'll be taking him to my oldest son's school and uh, I guess after that I probably will take my oldest with me there's no point of him uh, staying in school when um, pretty much is done so uh, yeah that's pretty much it yesterday I was kind of bummed that I lost the paper because I had some minor notes here and there but today workout I was surprised I had the energy um, uh, considering yesterday I did full body also but anyway I didn't read my uh, heart rate result yesterday my watch was giving me some issues I think the battery is almost done so I probably need to change it because it was giving me a hard time today when I'm doing some uh, when I was doing the leg lifts usually when you're doing abs if you're doing it properly you hold your core tight and you're doing the lift just holding your core tight will burn a lot of calories so I'm looking at my watch as I'm doing the leg lifts it wasn't really it stays at 90 something I like something is not right so every now and then I'm fixing it on my eventually I had to go to the bathroom take it off and um, fix it and stuff like that so uh, I'll be surprised to see the amount of the result of this because it was not uh, I don't think it was showing the proper amount um, considering what I was doing during that time so for today June 15 2017 I started at 8.55. My training time is 1 hour 52 minutes and 11 seconds. That's full body. So it took me 2 hours to do that. Average heart rate 102. Highest heart rate 136. I, you see, 290 calories. Uh, yesterday, or the first... Uh, on Monday, I believe I, I burned close to either 800 calories like that for like two or three, two and a half hours. Uh, I'll post that result also. So today, the, I don't think this was working properly, but I'll take whatever it shows because that's what it is. I don't think it was working properly. So I was in my heart rate zone for one hour, four minutes and 21 seconds, which is half of the time I was at the gym. Uh, which equivalent to 57 percent and that's it so I'm gonna eat something uh, yesterday I made some uh, I made quinoa I did record it um, so let me do a quick uh, post-workout meal I ate two oatmeal cookies by the way on my way here so I'm not I sort of kind of hungry I guess because after I, I went up and down my, the stairs in my house so uh, trying to bring the paperwork so I'm gonna do a quick little post-workout meal here All right, let's see. let me wash my hand and then after that I'll just uh, take a shower and then go pick up my son I'm gonna need this to warm up some stuff So I'm gonna have a uh, tortilla wrap. Usually, this is like the easiest and quickest way. You know, after I warm this up, the tortilla, I'm probably gonna warm up the ground meat and the quinoa in here because it'll be easier. Right, so that's that. I'm gonna put this away. Vegetables. I'm not gonna use this to put my bed up in the microwave, so I'm just gonna put it in the microwave. This is the 
quinoa I made yesterday. I did some stir-fried vegetables and stuff like that with it. I'm gonna take half of it. That's my brownie. I'm going to throw in some extra vegetable. I don't really need it, but it seems like it could need some more. When you want to get off that darkest ground But gravity pulls you straight down That's it. That's my post-workout. Thanks for watching.